Hey everyone, it's Nancy, and I am back with another video for Wilder Kit Crafts for the Wild Bunch. And sorry, I've been missing in action. It's had a lot of stuff going on, but I got some mojo flowing and went a little crazy making some projects. Um, a lot of people do ornament exchanges, and I've seen some very, very beautiful ones and I decided that I wanted to give them a try. So I'll show you, this is the first one that I did. You can see the sparklies and goodies in there. Butterfly, beautiful flowers. There's some um, like dew drops in here. There's the German glass glitter from Water Kit Crafts and silver and gold. Um, there's a little crocheted flower down in there, and then just some pearls and other little colored beads. And then this is that curly stuff, like this, that you get to go on trees. So on the top of the ornament, beautiful water could craft roses. My favorite trellis roses. And this is the 40 millimeter, and then a 30 millimeter in the red. And then some, these are the hybrid tea roses, and then a cottage rose, and then the little tiny ones on the top. And I used um, stickles to add the shimmer to them. I think it was the crystal one is the one I used. Then a beautiful butterfly here. And then for the hanger, I used the flat back pearls. So we can hang like that. So this is the first one with some bling there. So that is one. And that's a gift. They're all gifts. And then this is a smaller one. And this is more non-traditional colors. This is in purples and whites. So another trellis rose. Trellis rose. And then these are the wild roses. And again, I use stickles on them to make them nice and shimmery and then these are the little 10 millimeter rosebuds in there and again with the pearls and added the butterfly and flourish and then inside this one it has the silver um, it's a netting I found it at Michael's and some more of the gold curly cues some this one has the gold um, German glass glitter in the 80 grit and the silver, which is also in the 80 grit, as well as some dew drops and things in there to make the inside sparkle. So that's the purple one. And um, these are actually for co workers. And um, I took the butterflies and just asked them which color they wanted. And this one, there were three that chose black. So this is one of the black ones. And so it's a black and white. Again, cottage roses, tea roses, and then the trellis rose here. And then on the top, the little black and white 10 millimeter. The black ones were actually, they're a deep midnight blue, but they're almost black. And I just added a little bit of a homemade mist in black to make sure that they were black black and then this one just has the silver in it with some more of the glitter and pearls and dew drops it also has the pearl hanger and then here's another black one and this one is a black and gold on the butterfly so it has the silver and the gold inside here you can see the sparklies in there. I love how that glitter looks down in there. And then this is a tea rose. More. This is a wild rose. Cottage rose. Tea rose. And then the little ones on the top here. So that's another one. The last black one is this one. And this one has... um like a multicolored glitter in the butterfly. So I added, this is sequins, 
It's called sequins. It's a glitz stickles by Ranger. So I put that as a multicolor. It's really pretty. And I put that on all the little flowers. And then on the inside, this one is the gold and silver as well. So those are the three black ones. And then this is a different style ornament. This is like a flat one. And I used the gardenia with, I created the center with the flat back pearl and the ribbon slide. And then some hybrid tea roses. I love these red and white ones with the gold on it. It's so pretty. You can see in there there's another little of the red crocheted flowers in there with a the little pearl in the center. Again, I used the halfback pearls for, to hang it. And I love this one. This one is the blue one. See how sparkly it is in there. It's got some blue colored pearls in there as well. And beautiful, beautiful trellis rose. One of my favorites. I love this color. It's the two-tone with the white and then with just the tips are colored. And then I just use the wild roses around that and then the 10 millimeters right in here. That butterfly is just beautiful. So that's another one. And then the last one that I want to share is this is one of the smaller ones, the smaller balls that you can get. And I actually went, these are plastic ones and I went to Michael's last night to get some more but they didn't have any more. So the trellis rose and the hybrid tea roses and then the little, I love these little red and white ones too. But it also has one of the little crocheted flowers in there and some of the German glass glitter. So you can use really any non-traditional flowers um, to make your ornaments. You don't have to use the poinsettias. Just beautiful. They're a lot of fun. And I have, <laughs> I did buy three boxes of glass ones. So I am going to make more. Um, but <laughs> for some reason I ran out of hot glue sticks. How do you run out of hot glue sticks, really? So anyway, I just wanted to share. I hope you all have a great holiday. Thanks everybody for watching and make sure to check out the Watercut Craft site. It's www.watercutcrafts.com. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later.